Hey guys, it's Katie Rose here from The Wild Duchelles, and I am back for another month of our top five beauty favorites of gifted products this month. As a blogger, you probably have seen over Insta stories and on YouTube that we get gifted a lot of products that are being launched into the market so that we can test them out for ourselves and let you guys know what we think. I do a lot of blogger mail on Instagram and I was really wanting to figure out how to sum up what we liked and what we didn't after we've been using it for a while. So instead of doing a blog post, I thought what better way than a YouTube video. So last month we started this, it was our top five. This month it's May, well I guess we're now into June, <laughs> and I wanted to show you guys our top five from May. So for me, I wanted to do a bit of a spotlight on a brand. Um, in December, we were gifted a Christmas present from a Canadian company that we worked with a lot in 2017, and they introduced us to many different smaller Canadian companies, one of which was a company called Capure. Now this is an all natural company um, that makes beauty products as well as skincare line, and they gifted us their natural deodorant, Get Closer. This is our first product we ever tried of Cape here and we fell in love. My husband even can use this. It's, I hate when they say strong enough for a man made for a woman. You remember that quote, but it is strong enough for a man. <laughs> so we are on our third jar of this now. And if you're looking for a natural deodorant, this is what you need. It is seriously amazing. It smells gender neutral. They also have it in a vanilla if you're wanting a little bit more of a fem feminine smell. Um, but it's so good. It is, I'll open it up. As you can tell, we've used it a lot. It is made out of charcoal, so it does have a gray tint to it. Sometimes it can get on your clothes, I will warn you, but it washes off really well, it doesn't stain, and we've been absolutely loving this product. So the next product's also from Cape Here. They sent me over this uh, about two months ago and I've been trying it out. So technically it's not May, but I've been loving it in May. In April, I was trying out a few different face washes and I found my skin was breaking out. So I decided to test this out. It's made for your face, but it's also made for kids. And so we've been using it on our kids in the bathtub, but I thought, why not actually try it as a face wash? And it has been doing amazing things for my skin. My skin is finally cleared. It doesn't have that tight feeling. One thing, it doesn't wash makeup off, so I definitely still use my makeup remover before I use this, but it has been a lifesaver so far, and I have very sensitive skin, and I am absolutely loving this face wash. And my last product from k -Pure for this month is their jade roller. Now this was just launched last month and I was able to get one. They do sell out of them quickly. I don't know if you know a ton about jade rollers, but they're blowing up in the beauty industry right now. Jade itself, the stone, has many different healing properties and then the way you use it actually helps your skin, helps your skin hold in that serums and it's just been super beneficial to me. And you know what, I don't even know all of the reasons why, but I absolutely love it. It's very cooling, so it helps with swelling in your face, especially around your eye areas. And what they do recommend is that you roll down towards your heart when you're rolling on your face because that actually allows for any drainage to go to your heart so that it can get dispersed and so you don't look so puffy in your face. Cape here sent me this one, absolutely love it. I'm gonna put a link below and on the blog. So if you are wanting to shop one, I believe this is $25. So it's a great price point as well. Last month, Sage Wellness also launched a baby line. We got to test out the entire baby line before we did a giveaway on our Instagram feed and we absolutely loved the line. One thing that they gave us though is a nipple cream. Now I'm no longer breastfeeding my kids anymore. So I didn't really know what to do with the nipple cream, but I was tipped off by one of the girls in head office that I should use it on my lips, which makes sense, right? Like your lips aren't made out of the same skin or similar skin as your nipples. So I started using it on my lips. It has actually worked amazing. I now keep it in my purse. I also like to use it before bed. I load it on before bed and I utilize it as like a lip mask while I'm sleeping and it has really helped my skin because I find in the in-between stages we are in the seasons my lips get a lot more chapped than usual and this has been helping a ton. 
And the final item that I'm going to highlight this month for May is going to be the Guest Who Face Masks. They've gifted us both the mud and the paper masks. Unfortunately, I have small face problems, so the paper masks don't really work on my face, but my husband absolutely loves them and he has told me that they have been amazing on his skin, but the mud masks for me have been awesome and I'm now into the whole routine where as soon as I work out at night I like to throw on a face mask once I've washed my face and these guys have really done a great job especially like I said with those in between seasons where your face doesn't really know if it's dry or if it's oily these guys are coming to the rescue the cucumber one is actually really good if you've seen a little bit too much sun that day too so these ones, so good. I've put a link below, make sure you check them out. And that's it, my top five beauty products for May. I hope you guys enjoyed this. I hope you learned a little bit more about some products. Cape here is definitely a place you need to check out, especially if you're a Canadian and you'd like to support local. If you like this video, make sure you hit that like button below. And if you wanna see more of these, make sure you hit subscribe. Thanks so much.